Good morning, Southwest Montana. 5.30 on this Wednesday. Chet Lehman, Missy O'Malley with you. That is our top story. Larry Nasser's former boss at Michigan State University used his power to sexually assault, harass, and solicit nude photos from female students, according to a criminal complaint. Now, William Strample, the former dean of MSU's College of Osteopathic Medicine, has been charged with one felony count of misconduct in the office and a misdemeanor account of the fourth-degree criminal sexual misconduct on his own actions as dean from 2002 to 2018. Now, according to court documents, Andy Rose has more on these charges. A man who once oversaw disgraced gymnastics doctor Larry Nasser has now himself been charged with sexual misconduct. As dean of the college, Strample used his office to harass, discriminate, demean, sexually proposition, and sexually assault female students. William Strample, the former dean of Michigan State University's College of Osteopathic Medicine, is facing multiple charges for his own alleged actions from 2002 to 2018. Four female students described how Strample allegedly wielded the power of his office over them while asking for nude photos and sexual favors. According to the criminal complaint, Strample told one female student she needed to learn her place and to be, quote, submissive and subordinate to men. Abuse the authority of his public office through threats of manipulation to solicit, receive, possess pornographic images of women who appear to be MSU students. Strample's attorney strongly denies the allegations. My client denies that he ever engaged in any inappropriate touching of anyone, any student or otherwise. He denies that there was any quid pro quo for sexual favors in exchange for any type of standing within the university of the medical school. This latest scandal for MSU comes as a Michigan special prosecutor investigates how Nasser was able to abuse more than 200 young girls and women for over two decades while at MSU. Strample faces two misdemeanor charges of willful neglect for failing to properly oversee Nasser. I'm Andy Rose reporting. Again, Michigan State University, just clarifying right. the MSU we're talking about there. 532, now Matt.